all right what up guys we back on that breach wave souls uh doing those summons again so i have been grinding this game mainly for you know partners and orbs just so i could do this uh banner that we have now or banner that we had last week this might be going up late um so i did like 250 summons or whatever or a total of 250 or close to 250 characters or whatever and i think it turned out pretty good i got a bunch of new characters a bunch of cool characters even got uh, the new Black Ichigo. We finally got our Black Ichigo, guys. 2020. Um, so, yeah, I think it turned out pretty good. I'm actually having fun using some of these other characters. I still have a lot to use. But I've been using um, one character in particular that I put in here. Um, just some footage of me using them. It's a pretty cool character. Stronger than I thought. But, yeah, this time when I had to play the game, it actually kicked me out. And I had to download, like, mid. Uh, I was doing, like, a stage. And I had to freaking download something again so you know they got the new technology so here are the care some of the characters I got on here um, some of the teams I'm running so I powered them up all to the max just so I can you know get them orbs and I got a, a nice uh nice amount of orbs I'm, I think I'm running out of the characters though so I might have to start grinding more just like orbs for the next banner which will be it's probably already live but it has um, stern uh, thousand year blood world version in hash wall and Busby, aka Basby. Busby. Um so yeah, those guys are looking pretty cool. But anyway, in this summon here I got I think I got uh some someone new on this one. It's kinda hard to see. No, nope, maybe the next one. So this is step five. So I think that's step oh wait, here it is right here. I get those reindeer soy phone. So I got the Christmas soy phone and Christmas Hanatharo. And I think that Oreo was new for me. Oh probably not. Got a decent looking chat over there. Yeah, so I did get a new soy phone here, so I'm going to have fun using her. Hopefully she's some good. Usually the holiday car characters are pretty cool. They have some nice animations and whatnot. So I think it's this one where I get the character. Oh, Grim Jail. I think that's a new one. I don't know if I got that one before. Nope, new Rukia though. This is weird because that's why I get like every type of Rukia, but there's so many types. There's probably like a thousand characters in this game. And there we go. Black Ichigo right there on the seventh step, I think. So it wasn't too bad, I guess. That's like kind of average. At least, you know, one. I got three Ichigos in this one, so that's like a triple Ichigo Whammy banner right there. And I think I did another step because I thought the rate would still be good. And I did get Ishin on the second one, so it's not too bad. Oh, he's a nice character. He's a new one for me, I think. But I looked back at the video and it said I had two Ishins and two Starks, which is weird. I don't know if I got them in this banner, but I summoned so much. Kind of hard to keep track. Yeah, see, I got another, another edition right there for my uh, free one or whatever. So I'm using all my tickets now. And I don't know if you can get really good characters here, but I did get like a 5-star nail, which is pretty cool. I think she's a new character for me as well. And then, you know, all these same dupe 3-stars, which is kind of good because I did need to level up a lot of my partners. But since I've been grinding um, other stages, it, it's no, really, no real use for them. And I, get, I think this is my first time getting a start. I know there's probably at least like three different versions of them, not counting the um, feel your fear your own world version. But I think that's my first time getting Stark in this game. I don't remember getting a, another one, which is kind of weird, but you know, I don't do that many banners. I try to do um, only the really big ones. And this is like the anniversary one, so I was like, yeah, you know, you got to do this one. I think I got a good deal too, and not get rejected here, so I didn't know if that's good or bad. So I'm like. I got another Stark, double Stark, and I got a double Ishin, which is crazy. I, I think I used the Ishin a little. He was like decent. I don't think I used the Stark yet though. But I, I was using the new Ichigo, and he's uh he's pretty neat. I don't know if he's better than Byakuya, but um, I, I'm liking him so far. But these next characters are supposed to be like really um game changers. And they got some nice animations and some uh, new effects, I think as well. Like a uh, status changing, status reflection, I mean. So your statuses go to uh, the enemy after they special. Well, I don't know if it's after they special, but it's like an effect that they have. Or ability or whatever. And they got some new, uh, a new mode that's coming out. I think it's like a new boss battle with the um, uh, Quincy's versus the Quincy's or something like that. So yeah, I'm doing all these summers, and then for this one, the free, um, free character, five star. Um, I picked a, a blue character because every time I play, I, I feel like I always 
in lack of a good blue character even though every time I pick one it seems to be I pick a blue character but I don't know I never find any that I like really but they get Towson so it's pretty cool I think I don't even have that many um, high level Towson's most of them are like level 3 so for this one I was picking up some cool characters um, just people I wanted to like use and then I thought about it I was like yo since we got the black strawberry in the game now and it's 2020 I'm just gonna pick all black characters and see what I get so I pick only all black people, all the darkest people in the game, and Harry Bell too. I mean, she counts. She's kind of tan, you know. She be at the beach a lot. Yo, oh, dang, the Harry Bell. Yo, her, her animation was like, yo, she's real bouncy in there. Her and Orihime. So you know, that definitely worked all the downloads of this game. But anyway, I was picking all the dark characters, and then I, for the last one, I picked. I think I picked Mayuri. Even though he got the little black face, black face going on, but you know that's okay. I, I like that slack as Mayuri. Um, yeah, and guess what they gave me? This is ridiculous right here. Like, you could not make a better um, setup right here. So, I picked all the black people, right? And they gave me this dude. The dude with the biggest lips shooting out black power symbols. That's that's crazy. I don't know if that was set up or not. You guys let me know. I don't know. It's just kind of really, really big coincidence that that happened. So, also summoned some accessories. Um, I don't know if I got anything really good. I doubt it. I was using up all my tickets. I think this is the first time I actually summoned for accessories. And I had like a freaking lot of them. I don't know, it's probably like close to a hundred summons or whatever. Maybe even more. But yeah, I'm gonna start using those now, powering those up. It takes quite a bit to power these up. I mean not really that much, but um Yeah, may actually it takes probably a decent amount of materials to power these up. I think I powered up some of the bigger ones, the better ones, level four, I mean the four star ones. But nothing really, you know, none none of the golden chappies or the real ones that give you like the mega boost. So I need to uh, probably spend orbs on this because I think all of these were mostly like the free ones that I saved up over the years so for free summons. So anyway, that happened. Most of them like just increased HP or you know damage. I mean the ones that I use now, and I still didn't get a pet yet. I know there's a thing you can get like a little Chibi Bayakia or Chibi Aeon or something. So I gotta figure out how to get those as well. And I did do some Guild War uh, tests, and I actually was doing damage. I don't know if I put it in this video or then, or if I left it out. It was a lot of like little. I had like four or five different um, recordings or whatever of summons because I did it the first day I did all the free ones, then the second day I, I put that in there, the second free summons, and then the third day I think it's that the third day is when I really started doing the steps. It was like a lot of little recordings. Next time I'm gonna probably just do it in one step so it's easier, which will probably be sometime soon because you know the banner is up by now. The um, Quincy. Or not, it's not really the Quincy banner, but it's Basby, Hashwalt, and Stern Uryu. Stern Rider Uryu. Looking pretty neat. And I still got like a nice amount of orbs. Um, like in this video right now, I have 12,000 or whatever. But I think by the time I summon, I'll probably get back up to 2,000 maybe. Just gotta grind it a little more. Might do that later today. But yeah, these are the characters I have now. They're pretty neat. I got a couple of 5 stars. I mean, a couple of 6 stars. Some characters I might have to resurrect once. I'm thinking about this new Ichigo. Might as well just resurrect him because he's new. And maybe two other characters that I really like. Because I didn't even notice that beforehand my Ichigo was not max level. Because um, I still had to get some other materials that I had to ground for. So I, I leveled up a bunch of partners and whatnot. And I got that, uh. What's his name? Zomimaru? Yeah. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And hopefully I can summon on the next banner and get some cool stuff and actually did some summons on this other banner and I got Shinji so that was pretty cool I thought that was the newest Shinji but it wasn't it's an older one but it's you know Shinji's always cool I like Shinji because he's a visor he's you know he's got that cool theme song as well and it's the old captain version too so that's even better so yeah hopefully I can get some good stuff on the next one Okay, so we're back in that boss battle again. This time I'm actually doing some damage. I don't think I really changed anything on the team, but for some reason, these characters finally got their stuff in line and they're actually doing some damage. Um, so hopefully when I add in my new team, which I don't know who it will be, but it will probably definitely be that new Ichigo. Maybe the Asian and Stark or something. Maybe I can find out a better combination. But um, yeah, so I'm actually doing damage in this one. Hopefully I can help out my guild more and increase our points and rank and whatever. And I just pop up some characters like triple Ichigos, quadruple Ichigos. I don't have any of those by the way. I mean I have like maybe one of those. Um, and then, yeah, This is one of the characters, characters that I was talking about, one of my favorites at the moment. 
Sajin using freaking keto spells and everything. Like this is a very good version because he's like ranged, so he can really keep the enemies at bay. So he, this guy barely gets touched because um, he can just push him back so easily. He actually surprised me. I didn't think he would be um, as good and as fun as he is to use, but he's very freaking fun to use and to, um, yeah, to play with. Yeah, even if they go like you know they go into like the shadows or whatever, he can still hit them with his normal attack. So that's pretty cool. Because those enemies are like some of the most annoying enemies because usually you have to wait to hit them. But um, since he's ranged, he can hit them even while they're still in their freaking shadow mode or whatever. I don't know if that's exclusive to ranged characters, but it seems like it. Um, yeah, I wonder when we're going to get an Ichigo that can use keto spells. Because basically Ichigo, he can do a little hand-to-hand -hand combat. Well, that's how you start it off. Then he got to the sword and everything. Then he just spams, get you, gets to go with Chinchos and whatever. But I wonder, wonder if we're going to get like a keto Ichigo. I mean, because Kisuke is like the freaking keto god. Yeah, right there he just uh, summoned the meatball and then sliced it right in front of your eyes. Yeah, freaking Benny Hanna chef action, Sajin. So yeah, um, I wonder if we can get like a Keto Kisuke. I mean, Keto um, freaking Ichigo. If you don't already have one, I'll probably miss them. But yeah, that'd be pretty cool to see. Since he does, um, you know, study under Kisuke, who like invented all the freaking Keto, might as well have. So yeah, that's it.